guys welcome to minimalism sunday um don't have much to talk about this week um just gotta work on getting some topics to talk about what would you all like to hear what would you all like to talk about that would be my question one of the things that i was talking to i'm trying to get this thing i'm sorry if i'm shaking it i was talking to sherry on saber spender and i started following her when she was fabulously broke in the city.com and she used to talk a lot about makeup companies that were cruelty free and things like that so i was looking for a lip gloss because i know some of the companies that i have been using are not truly cruelty chemical free so she was just giving me you know what i should be looking for i wound up founding this company let me see if i can get it to focus lip locks and they make organic um lip balm so i've got one on now i keep one in my purse i keep one in my bag and it's organic coconut oil organic beeswax organic castor seed oil wildcrafted shea butter organic rose hip seed oil cranberry seed oil avocado oil and all flavors made from 100 percent natural flavor oils and this is the unflavored one it's naturally nude so there are no flavors in here but yeah i got this and i really like it so far it doesn't cause any reactions or anything. I'm really, my body is really funky about reacting to stuff. I also um, bought a new face wash because my old face wash was really starting to break me out here. I think it was too rough for my face. And so I'm still looking for a good one because I've gotten two of the Trader Joe's. I got the everyday one and then I have the tea tree one. And the tea tree one is the one that started to break my face out because I was using it a lot. So I switched over to the everyday one, but I'm not sure if I can use it because my face is dry now. Um, I have eczema, so sodium lauryl sulfate causes me to break out real bad. Like it causes the eczema to flare real bad. So I'm working on that. If you all have any ideas of face washes that I can do that won't cause my eczema to flare, let me know. Because I know a lot of the time soap net are the ones that people are using now in the place of the sodium lauryl sulfate to get it to lather so if you all know of any that contain that that'd be great i'm trying to change most of my stuff over to organic and or i'm trying to think of the word for it cruelty free organic or cruelty free um and I'm trying to make sure I get items that are not caustic to the environment. So if you all have any, please let me know. Like my deodorant, I've already switched over to Primal Pit Paste. My toothpaste currently is Tom's. Um, yeah, I think that's all I've changed so far. Uh, most of the stuff I clean the house with is a uh, organic type of a house cleaner that I'm migrating to. I switched to seventh generation for the toilet cleaner. I've got a orange type of a cleaner for the counters in the kitchen. And yeah, I'm looking for ideas, guys. So whatever you all can give me, I'm also looking for ideas for upcoming blogs. As far as minimalism goes, what would you all like to know? What are you interested in? Let me know. Comment below. And until next time, I'll see you guys.